Okay, Moran interior. I've heard all of Dandelion's ballads about you. Lambert tells me I'll never be as fast as a real witcher. But I managed to hit him during training today. You beat Lambert? Yeah, we were fencing on the floor pegs when that strange storm came. Lambert looked away. I did a pirouette, hit him right in the gut. Uh, he didn't fall, and then he beat me. You'll make a good swordsman yet. I know. <laughs> Every time Lambert beats me, he says I have potential. Leave. I played some of uh, this uh, before, but I didn't finish this part of the story. In OTS mode, uh, double tap a directional key. ESA the to talk to enemies. Double tap a directional key. Ah, Mess with me and die. Styles, group style. The group style is most effective against groups of weaker opponents. Switch this style by left clicking on the griffin icon or by pressing C. These stairs lead to the lab. Follow me. The energy you annexed from the Circle of Elements is enough to stop the witches? You tremble, yet you complain Savola would have them all, leaving none for you. Did the sight of a single witcher, White Wolf himself, instill fear? The aforementioned considered dead I might add is a known killer. I'll gladly challenge him. Leo, stand back. Come on, Professor. Time is essential. I wield the power of the Circle of Elements. They are no threat. Back to work. I want the mutagens ready for teleportation in 15 minutes. Our witches shan't trouble us. We 
We're cut off. The stairs are blocked. The magic barrier looks solid. We need Triss. They're robbing us. Geralt, clear the passage upstairs. Use a sign. A sign? The Ard. I can't do it since I broke my fingers training along the gauntlet. Cast the Ard at the debris. I don't remember the signs. Let's go to the Circle of Elements, a source of the power. You need to try and learn the Ard. All right. So I need to follow this guy, not let him get away. Elemental circles. Left click on the elemental stone to learn a sign. Tip, look for other elemental circles later in the game to learn new powers. Right. Here it is. Success? We'll see in a minute. I knew it would work. Let's get back before Lambert kills the Frightener himself. Science Ord. The Ord sign is a telekinetic force useful for clearing obstructed pathways or for uh, knocking back opponents. Right click on the target to cast the sign. Tip, knock down or stun enemies are easy to kill with a single strike. Now you need to follow this guy again before he runs away. It would be harder to find our way otherwise. I hate uh, navigating these uh, catacombs. Pyramid like places. Here is this thing. What did you learn? The bandits are in the lab, searching for something. The mage used the circle of elements to create a magic barrier. The plague! You're all children. Why didn't you mention the circle? Triss, child. It didn't seem important. If the mage aligned with the circle, he can create a stable portal through which he'll travel to anywhere on the continent, taking your equipment with him. All right, we made a mistake. But you said the mage was harmless. I said I didn't know him. I think we should protect the lab above all. Don't panic, Marigold. We know you'd like to see our witch's secrets. Vesemir, if that idiot doesn't shut it, I'll... Enough! Lambert, stop baiting Triss. Show her some respect. Triss, if we go to the lab, they'll have us surrounded. We know tactics. Maybe we should split up. Geralt's right. We need to protect the lab and kill the Frightener. Who goes where? Only I can break the barrier. I'm going inside. Vesemir? I'll stay and handle the Frightener and Savola. What about you, Geralt? We may both need your help. I'll stay and handle the Frightener and Savola. What about you, Geralt? We may both need your help. Yeah, that's what he said. Uh, so we have two options. One, the lab is important. I'm going with Triss. Or two, I'll handle the Frightener with Vesemir. I guess the lab is important. I'm going with The lab Triss. is important. I'm going with Triss. Me too. It's decided then. Eskel and Lambert will stay with me. Savola just cast a spell. Something's happening. The ground is shaking. Feel it? They're breaking through. Watch out! Defend the laboratory! Okay, more an interior. 
here. This could be a hard fight, Geralt. Take this potion. Witchers call it the Tawny Owl. It restores endurance. Very useful when fighting mages. Thanks. Let's go. Drink the potion. All right. We can't afford to lose any more time. Let's go. All right, you need to go somewhere. They are following me like a party. Nice. You'll go no further, White One. I'll summon a powerful demon that will tear you apart! A bluff. He's exhausted from teleportation. Magic light is about all he can muster. Go. We'll deal with him and join you at the barrier. Underestimating an opponent. Now the energy of my gun will make me stronger. Are you hurt? Yeah. Did he get you? Nah. But if those were magic lights, I'd hate to face a truly powerful sorcerer. I wanted to help, but I couldn't break through that strange circle. Savol is eating dirt. That's what matters. We need to help Triss. Let's go. Can you get something from his body? Chicken sandwich. Sapphire valuable, a valuable item. It can be sold or given to someone. Silver rubber ring. Yeah. Same text. <coughs> Suet, high quality base for blade coatings. Orans, Timerian currency. Nice. Some blood here too. Next to his body. body. Kitchen is locked. Let's explore. They're ransacking the laboratory. The other mage is. I underestimated him. Hurry. She has been in a fight and is defeated almost. Up the stairs. I remember they were broken. Can't go this way. Go down then. Found it. We have what we came for. Professor, deal with those witches.
I hear witches can parry bolts in flight. Ribs, punctured lung. He's dying. He needs White Rufford's decoction. Hang on, Leo. It was here. I can't find it. Vesemir, Leo is dead. How did this happen? He attacked the professor. I was late. It's not your fault, Geralt. We're all to blame. Triss barely made it fighting for us. These are bad times for witches, and something tells me they'll only get worse. Is it safe up top? Relatively. Some stragglers up there, but we'll deal with them later. You look tired. I'd like you to rest. I'll keep watch and tend to Leo's body. Meditation. Left click on the medallion I can... Left click on the meditation icon in the dialogue to enter the meditation mode. Tip, choose how long to medita meditate by clicking on the um, noon, dawn, midnight or dusk icons or by moving the meditate slider. <coughs> you look tired, I'd like you to rest. I'll keep watch and tend to Leo's body. You have only one option. I'll rest a bit and prepare or I'll find you later well we have two options let's rest character development you earn talents use these to upgrade character features that include attribute signs and combat styles select the feature you want to enhance from the list on the left then choose from among the highlighted enhancements in the ability tree on the right uh, select the feature you want to enhance from the list on the left uh, this list uh, uh, then choose from among the highlighted enhancements in the ability tree on the right I see to commit your choices left click on the hourglass to cancel and uh, to commit your choices left click on the hourglass to cancel and start over left click on the case I can all right meditate till noon meditate till dusk meditate till midnight meditate till dawn Seventeen hours. Say it's noon. Meditate till dusk. So strength level um, one. Only option. <laughs> Cancel stress, stress distribution of talents, I see. Three or hands, girl scales. Four, no, we have characters. A skill. Common reasonable witcher from Kair Moran. He's my peer, I wonder how he got that disfiguring scar. Lambert, the young witcher I met at Kaer Moran sure has a bitter tongue. He's rude, especially to Triss Marigold, who he addresses by her last name. Leo, Leo is the youngest of Kaer Moran's residents. He's not a full witcher, though he has completed his training, he was not subjected to mutation. Leo comes across as a hot-headed whelp, but he's also kind-hearted and good. It appears that Leo is somewhat fascinated with me. He has heard the, he has heard the ballads about the white wolf and now holds me in high regard. 
Leo was killed by the professor, one of the leaders of the assault on Claire Moran. The boy was too hasty and inexperienced. I wasn't able to help him, even though I was right beside him. Mysterious mage. The mage attacked Claire Moran in order to steal the witches, uh, witcher's secret hidden in the fortress. One of the leaders of the forces that attacked Kael Moran was a mage so powerful that even Triss Marigold could not oppose him. The organization that he leads uses the symbol of a salamander. Professor. <coughs> One of the leaders of the salamander's attack on Kael Moran was a man called the Professor, who seemed to be a cunning assassin. The other leader was a mage. Triss Marigold. Along with me and the other witchers, Triss fought in the defense of Kael Moran. The sorceress stood against the mysterious mage, one of the leaders of the assault. She was injured and lost consciousness. Ironically, Triss was, is allergic to magic that can only be administered uh, natural healing potions. Vesemir. Vesemir is the oldest and most experienced witcher, possibly older than Kael Moran itself. He spends each winter in the fortress and sets off on the road when spring comes, just like all the others. Despite his age, Vesemir is robust and lively. Many youngsters could curve him his health. Uh, many youngsters could envy him his health. An excellent uh, fencer, he was the one who taught me swordsmanship. He has raised many witchers, including me. His, dis his disciples treat him like a father. Leo was probably the old witcher's last fatigue. The boy's death struck him. Locations. We have been in Kael Morhen and in the laboratory where we are now. Monsters. We have met zero monsters yet. Uh, tutorials. We have done some of them already. Glossary mages. Ingredients. Aether, indicated in purple, is a basic alchemical substance. It is found in many ingredients, including herbs, minerals, and monster parts. Ragenium, indicates it's basic alchemical. Uh, I see there is some different alchemic substances there. Okay. Quest, defending Kael Moran. Okay, cancel tracking. Hero again. Let's do that. Strength level 2 plus immunity to pain. Works only when Garrod is intoxicated. Alright, we're done. Meditate. Himself. The map here. Potion preparation. Select the formula to add ingredients to the vial automatically. Then left click on the mix at the bottom right side. Okay. Same game. I need to click on the middle there. Mosses and grasses. The smell is heady.
All that's missing is a mage who'd know how to use this. Hello, significantly increases vitality regeneration. Let's get that. Here I have someone. Eskel came by while you were resting. Triss is still unconscious, but stable. That's a relief. I've made a decision, Wolf. We abandon Kaer Morin. There's nothing holding us here. I see. We need to bid Leo farewell and wait for Triss to recover. And the bandits? Yes, we need to finish things. But first, we must make a healing potion for Triss. We'll need to search for ingredients. Nothing useful left here. I can do that. How do I make the potion? Lambert will give you the formula. Look for him by the fireplace. He's with our brave sorceress. Lambert? He doesn't hate Triss? Feels guilty, I think. The first thing Triss will hear when she wakes is, Finally awake, Marigold. That's Lambert. Let's get to work. Later, I'll teach you how to extract ingredients from monsters. I'll be in the main hall. Fine. Thronal. Left click on the scroll icon or press G to open the Thronal. Press quest to see your next mission. Choose the potion for Triss quest. Left click track quest to track the mission on the map. I see. Click on Thronal. Quests. Potion for Triss. Track Chris on the map. It is laboratory. To try to reach. Sorry if she's still there. something wrong no time to talk I need to make a potion for Triss you should find a vial of white gull in the armory on the upper floor grab some calcium equum from the evening hall look for white stones in one of the chests if you find any stragglers finish them we don't need prisoners the stairs are through that door I'd go but Marigold lies unconscious by the fire where's the calcium equum where's the again? calcium equum again in the evening hall inside a chest Evening hall inside a chest. Where can I get some Where alcohol? Where can I get some alcohol? There should be white gull in a crate in the armory on the upper floor. The room's full of weapons, you'll know it when you see it. Where can I get some alcohol? There should be white gull in a crate in the armory on the upper floor. The room's full of weapons, you'll know it when you see it. Alright. Lambert, Lambert, I have to tell you something. What is it? Leo. The bandits killed him. He wasn't ready. What a loss. We'll hunt them down, Wolf. We'll avenge Leo. I'll find you later. Pair potions in meditation mode. Gather the required ingredients first. Witcher George, slaying a dragon. 
Here is the fireplace. Here is Mary Cool. Left click on a left click on a lit campfire to enter meditation mode. What? Where's the calcium equum again? In the evening hall, inside a chest. Where can I get? There should be white gull in a crate in the armory. The room's full. I'll find. Fight some enemies soon. Courtyard door. It's the wrong area. Hmm. Seems witches have always been better with a sword than with a paintbrush. Here we get fish, gutted fish, Visseman champion, metal leg. I'll make you squeal. with me and die. Great. And a potion.
Turn off floating messages like too fast and final attack the game option. Frighteners book. The book discusses Frighteners. Nice. Unknown potion. Saltpeter. High quality base for bombs. Radanian layer. Weak alcohol. Ah, that's the alcohol. Calcium ichium. Chemical ingredients contains the following substances. Uh, 
Oh, I see. Ooh, I wasted an attack there. Weapon damage 5 to 15. Damage minus 30 percent. Steel sword used to fight humans in effect against most monsters used in ritual combat styles. There is the chest, I'm fucking blind. Okay, I'm on the ocean. Monster my portrayal of witchers. Let's go. Nice. Quest. Stairs to the ground floor, we need to go there, yeah. Need anything, Wolf? I have some questions. What is it? What do I use as the base for my potion? What do I use as the base for my potion? Alcohol. The better it is, the purer and more powerful your potion. You seem to feel at home here. Well, I've always preferred an armory to a lab. Though Vesemir plays up the importance of potions, he's hardly an expert. After all, he's always taught swordplay. Still, he tries to teach us everything he learned when he was young, and that was a while back. But to be honest, I don't care for all these powders, mushrooms, and other trash. Couldn't Triss have helped with Leo's mutation? Maybe. It's a little more complicated than that. See, we've never shown her the lab. And the last mutation was completed years ago, before the battle. Vesemir can tell you more. You really think Triss never used magic to peek inside? She respects our secrets, and she's done a lot for us. For you. I trust her. So why haven't you shown her the lab? Triss would like to use our secrets to heal people and such. I've no doubt she'd try. But it's never that simple. Ever heard of the gnome Alfred Nabel? Eskel, I have amnesia. An incomparable inventor, like most of his race. Through years of research, he discovered an amazing substance. He intended it for use in mines and quarries. Though a genius, Alfred failed to foresee his invention's possible applications. Others quickly realized that a substance designed to rip granite from the ground could destroy castle walls. Some even considered using it in open battle. I get it. So what happened to Alfred's discovery? Mages stopped it from spreading. Alfred committed suicide, and his lab burned down. Tell me about the trial of the grasses. It's a three-stage process. The first is the choice. Leo completed it, enduring the hard training and diet. 
I presume it's more than your basic lettuce and carrots. Special mushrooms, mosses, and herbs are grown in the lab. Combined with training, they accelerate muscle growth and digestion, improving the body's general condition. Does everyone pass the first stage? Unfortunately not. The liver and heart often fail, the mind sometimes too, resulting in excessive aggression. What's the second stage? The trial of the grasses. More idiotic tales have been conjured up about that than about princesses and dwarves. Before the raid, the lab contained vials, hearths, formulae, herbs, and the grasses. A mage and his magic were all that was lacking. Did you ever witness a trial? Just one. Our own. I thought I was going to lose it when your hair turned white. The grasses affect the nervous system, so magic must control the process. The trial results in lightning-fast reflexes. Reaction times normal people will never attain. Only four out of ten survive. Quite a cut. And the last stage? I don't know the specifics. It involves changes like the mutation of the eyes, the bone marrow, hormones. In exchange, we see in the dark, heal much faster than ordinary folk, and gain increased resistance to poison. Interesting. What's the cost? We're infertile. The changes are irreversible? Entirely. Did you see the magic storm? Yes, I was out hunting. Just before the storm came, a swarm of night jars took flight. Hundreds of them. Gray streaks across the sky, trilling wildly. Usually less of them gather, and their cries rarely sound so desperate. When the storm came, I gave up the hunt and headed toward Kaer Morin. Met the others on the way. We'll talk later. What do you need? Done. I have the ingredients, and it's safe upstairs. Good. You'll need two more things to make the potion. The claw of a mighty beast, and some celandine. Vesemir will tell you where to find them. Let me teach you the formula. That was a tough fight. I found a few intruders upstairs, but... I understand they won't be a problem. Lambert, however, let the Frightener get to him. Nothing serious. Good you went after Triss and handled that mage. She was able to salvage some equipment, but it looks like the main device has vanished. Our beautiful sorceress was right, I know. You did well, Wolf. Take this armor and sword. I've been keeping them for you. Lambert gave me the formula. I take it you already have white gall and calcium equum. I do. What next? You'll need celandine. Take what I have. Plus the claw of a monster like the Frightener. To skin a creature, take a sharp knife and cut along the torso. You'll find the Frightener's carcass in the upper courtyard. Once you've extracted the claw, rest by the fire while making the potion. I see a new look now. Seems we need to go to the courtyard. Surprised if it if it wouldn't find any enemies here. Cage bench, frightened carcass. Let's see, I need to go somewhere else. This is the right path. Thanks. 
extract the alchemical components. Left click on the monster carcass. Ah, fragness eye, fragness claw. Chronal. Intercitral interior, we need to go back. wrong. You'll have to find more. Where? I'll have another claw and more celandine. Eskel has alcohol and I saw calcium equum somewhere upstairs. But try to get it right the first time. It's not that hard. Where are Lambert and Eskel? Upstairs. Lambert's in the library and Eskel's taking Triss to a room. Are there other witchers? There were three witcher schools in all, but it's been long since I've heard word of the other two. You've met all the witchers I know of, except for Berengar. Did I know him? I don't believe so. An introvert, he chose his own path. Actually, none here can say they know Berengar. He often ran away from Kaer Morhen, though he would always return in the end. After the trial of the grasses, he finally accepted his destiny and started training for real. Why isn't he here? I don't know. We lost touch with him a while back. Can I ask you something? Of course. Who was Leo? One of hundreds of orphans of the war with Nilfgaard. I apprenticed him six years ago. I'm sorry. We'll recover our secrets and find Leo's murderers, even if they fled to the end of the world. Can I ask you something? Of course. You mentioned defending Kaer Morhen before. Yes. Fifteen witchers once lived here, training boys for their trials. Only they knew the secrets of mutation. Witchers who set out on the path and failed to assimilate among humans wintered here. Before the battle, 23 witches and 40 students called Kaer Morhen home. Too damned few for the mob that attacked. I never knew why they came. Some say a sudden explosion of anger born of disdain for witches. But no. Someone provoked the mob with flyers filled with lies. Special agents read them to the peasants. Truer still. The fanatics could never have taken the fort without the aid of sorcerers, though they outnumbered us by far. They didn't even spare the youngest. I alone survived, concealed among the corpses. Walk around, Wolf. The skeletons remain. You may find a flyer. There used to be hundreds. Memorize it as a warning of the evil humans can perpetrate. I have all the ingredients. Good. Now rest, and prepare the potion according to the formula. We'll speak later.
ट्रेस Frighteners claw with ingredients providing a total of one measure each of rabies and vitriol. One measure each of rabies and vitriol. Potion is made by mixing a frighteners claw with ingredients. Ingredients providing a total of one measure each of rabies and vitriol. Duration of effects immediate, toxicity none. Vitriol, rabies. According to Lambert's instructions, the potion for the unconscious sorcerer's trees can be made of celandine, a frightener's claw, and a suvent mushroom. To uh, calcium equim can replace the later ingredient. Once gathered, this compound should be mixed with the white girl. So calcium acum, celandine, frighteners claw. Redanian Lager, excellent beer, brewed from Redanian Berlin. Chicken, alright. Dresser here. Have you got something there too? 
Gifts. Double click on the healing potion to give it to Triss. In favors of other characters by giving them gifts. Alright. I have something for you. Thank you, Geralt. I hope this potion helps. That was terrible. I dreamt Lambert was with me. He was staring at me, saying things like, Don't go dying on me, Marigold. Calling me big-headed. I'm so glad to see you. What? I'm glad you're feeling better. I know we should set out. But I have a feeling we won't be back. Perhaps ever. Won't you stay just a bit longer? With me? So two options. I suppose we have some time. I'm so happy you're back. When I saw you, all the feelings I tried to deny returned. Stronger than ever. Triss, I'm not ready to talk about the past. Of course. I, I shouldn't pressure you. I just feel so... <laughs> the powers. I'm behaving like a teenager. Let's focus on the present. I guess I disappointed you all. Forgive me. Nothing to forgive. What I felt when I learned you were alive... Hard to compare to anything. Oh... Except maybe what I feel as I look at you. I missed you so. Let's see if the best bed in Kaer Morin can hold us. Geralt, a pleasure, as always. As always? You don't remember anything? Unfortunately. Well, you have something to look forward to then. No matter. Tell me, how did the battle end? They broke into the lab, killed Leo, stole our mutagens, and escaped. Poor Vesemir. Another protege dead prematurely. We delayed the funeral until you awoke. Thank you. As for the mutagens, their loss could prove catastrophic. Let's not lose any more time. Unless there's something you'd like to ask me? Know anything more about the sorcerer who ransacked the lab? He's very powerful. He completely controlled the energy he drew from the Circle. We may soon be facing another Vilgefortz. Who? No matter. I have something I'd like to teach you. Geralt, can we go? Can you restore my memory? I'd have to examine you. There's a good chance your memory will return on its own. How much chance? That's difficult to say. It might help if I knew what caused you to lose your memory. Well, no time for that now. Geralt, can we go? The theft. What are its possible consequences? Most sorcerers and rulers would sell their greedy, power-hungry souls to get the mutagens. Only a master of the arcane arts can use that knowledge. Not many of those left. What about wealthy merchants, dukes, kings? Perhaps. Anything's possible. But speculating wastes time. We just don't have enough information. True. Geralt, can we go? We shouldn't keep Vesemir waiting. Come on, then.
We don't know where the bandits came from or who's behind them. We'll draw attention if we venture out as a group. By splitting up, we can also cover more territory. I'll go west. I know a few people there, and I prefer the coastal then planet. Then I'll head east, to Kedwin, unless someone objects. That's fine. Which way should I go? South, to Tamaria. King Foltest owes you a debt of gratitude. Some time ago, you removed a curse from his daughter. You might happen on the bandit's trail there. And you, Triss? I'll try to use my influence to find the bandits. If I learn anything, I'll contact Geralt. I'll gather what information I can and find you in Vizima. Triss. Don't, Geralt. I detest goodbyes. I'm liable to cry, and there's nothing more pathetic than a sorceress in tears. Don't get killed, Geralt. I don't think I could deal with that again. I'll see you soon. See you, Triss. Bandits succeeded in stealing secrets which the Witcher had been guarding for centuries. Her leader, a Sericanian mage, proved him too powerful even for Triss Merigold. Witcher set out in search of the stolen secrets, classically to the four corners of the world. Here at Rivia went south to Visima 